Yo son guys, back in our video, so in my last video I looked at the apparent alleged new information of Austin McBroom cheating on Catherine Pye yet again. So, you're just going to block my number, to which she says, I have nothing to say, Austin McBroom had responded with, look, we need to talk, don't need you saying anything to anyone, and delete these messages after I send them. Now look at these messages, they can easily be photoshopped for all we know, literally nowadays it's so easy to fake all these messages, but then again it's Austin so you never know. Well since this, in that video I spoke about this beauty kid called Cole Cardigan, where he brought up the whole Ace Family situation, how Austin's a complete scumbag. Well since this, he's tweeted out some even more outrageous statements, which yet again sparked more controversy. The original tweet that got Cole Cardigan involved with the situation, he tweeted out, how does no one know their entire brand is fake? Austin has ever so many of my friends recently, brackets, even one girl with his own father, and Catherine knows and is okay with it as long as he's home in time for the vlogs. Well, clearly, Cole Cardigan he had a lot more on his mind to say about the whole Ace family, Austin McBroom, and how much of a scumbag he is, where he tweeted out, This whole situation is making me feel uneasy. I hate inserting my stuff into fudge. But when it involves my friend, it becomes my business and knowing the disgusting criminal acts going on behind closed doors with this family makes me sick. Like when you think about it, this kid, he's saying some outrageous statements with little to no proof other than his word against the Ace family's word. This is really a sign of defamation. If it does come out that all these cheating rumours are complete bollocks, then dear lord, I feel sorry for this kid because a fat lawsuit is coming his way. He then went full big bollocks and tweeted out, The fact that millions of people are unknowingly supporting a cheater and a rapist makes me sick to my stomach and paying off a drama channel 500 grand to stay quiet. Now this is where things are going a bit out of hand because the fact he's claiming that Osmond Broom is a rapist with little to no proof is literally crazy. Now when he said paying off a drama channel 500k, I'm sitting there and I'm thinking who the bloody hell is Cole Carden talking about? Then it came to my attention, of course it has to be Killer Keemstall, the platform he has, because in his latest video he released like three, four days ago, he said this at the end of the video. Now, all I know is tomorrow on Drumler, we are going to talk about Austin. That's right, Austin from the Ace Family cheating. We have a big story coming out tomorrow, so make sure you tune into that. And he clearly stated the next day a video will come out. Well, he released that video to do with Mr. Beast around three days ago on the 9th of October. It's now the 13th. And people realising what the hell's going on and where's this video. Of course Keemstar saw all these people saying what the hell's going on, where's the video, what's happened to it. And he tweeted out, dude asked me how much did the Ace family pay to not make the video. I said 500 grand sarcastically. Now he said make an exposed video. Truth is the woman I planned on interviewing when MIA thought it was rude he would assume that I would sell out my multi-million dollar brand, shake my head. Now when he says MIA, this can clearly mean a numerous amount of things. Easily, the Ace family, being Austin, could have paid the girl to shut up her mouth, or maybe he completely threatened her, saying we can do a lawsuit if you try and make up all these bollocks on Drama Alert. Or maybe three, she realised, you know what, my story is completely bollocks, I'm not going to go ahead with it. Cole Cardigan then finished up his Twitter rampage by saying, I never would normally make a video like this, but I think I'm going to tonight for the sake of my friend and every other victim involved with Austin McBroomhead. You have two fudging daughters, you sick fudge. I have every receipt. Do I do it since they paid off drama alert? 500k to hush. And he's really throwing some personal digs at Austin McBroom now. He's clearly so angry at him. Claiming he's a rapist, saying he's gone with his friends. Jesus Christ, it's gone a bit too far. But then again, the beauty community is known for exaggerating everything 24-7. So he could be lying at his backside. He hasn't even released a video that he claimed he would the next day to do with the Ace family. What are you trying to do? Get a few more clicks. Because right now, we're waiting for the video, mate. As I always do on my channel, you look know by now. I give the active subscribers out there a shout out. And literally, all you need to do to be in a chance, if you do want to get shouted out, just be active on the channel. Whether it's liking, comment, subscribing, all different videos. And today's shout got someone called The Ninja Boy YT. And I know you said you wanted it on your birthday, but I'm sorry about that. All the past videos are pre-filmed, but I appreciate the support on the channel. Considering I made a video a couple of days ago looking at this whole Ace Family controversy, I thought it'd only be right to look at the Ace Family hardcore stands and see the comments they left under my video. First up, this kid called William Brown, he commented, 
They say he he's cheating so they can get with Catherine. It's now that hard, just finno. Although this person's grammar is that of a five-year-old, I can sort of understand it's just he's saying. I think he's trying to indicate the reason I bet he's cheating in a title is that because I want to get with Catherine. And mate, are you joking me? She lives in a multi-million dollar mansion. There's a bed right there waiting for me. A lovely comment left by Nikki Biblery. She commented, I'm going to need to punch you in the face for making me skim your rubbish video because you have to lie and title and clickbait people. And listen here, Nikki, look, you seem a bit upset, so you know what, I'm going to offer you my right cheek right now through your camera, just give me a quick smack into the jaw. Troy Manuel, he left a really educated comment where he said, you just is nosy. Mind your business, you don't have to post it on YouTube, that's their personal information. You know what, you're right, calling out a man for allegedly cheating on his girlfriend's soon to be wife numerous times while having two kids is something that should be kept quiet. Big Nut left a comment that reads, I feel terrible for Ellie and her sister, I do not remember her name, I'm sorry, I hope they don't grow up acting like their parents. If it does come out in like a week, two weeks, maybe a few months, that Osmond Broom cheated on Catherine while having kids Numerous times, it's going to affect them majorly considering the public platform they're on. Knowles and my Cody, don't know how the hell you pronounce that, she commented, Why are you guys hating so much? Like, they're just good YouTubers and that's how they win their money, so leave them alone and live your own life. Hang on a minute, what are you trying to say? Are you trying to claim YouTube is a platform where you win your money and it's a parent game? If that's so, I've been looking at it wrong the entire time. And leaving this segment on a complete bang, Celine Skebney commented, Damn. Who would cheat on Catherine? This is where I'm just so confused. Like, this man has no logic whatsoever. He's probably like 24, 25 years old, living in a multi million dollar mansion. He has a nice girlfriend, two healthy kids. What the hell is this guy beating around the bush for? So, you know what, Catherine, if you're watching this video, you're probably not. I'm handing in my CV to be your husband because that man is a scumbag and I want to move into your house. Anyway, guys, that's another video. I hope you did enjoy. Let me know in the comments down below what are your thoughts on this whole situation. Is he a cheating scumbag or not? Will this proof come out eventually? But make sure you follow up my social medias. Instagram's at LoveTube, same as the Twitter. But if you enjoyed this video, please do drop a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you later.